before you upload anything on your channel here is everything you need to set up your channel properly guys my name is Mudipe and you are welcome back to my youtube channel if you are a new subscriber thank you so much for joining this beautiful family and if you are a returning subscriber you are the real og you know it already so if you just opened your youtube channel or you already have a channel and you've been posting on it without putting all these things in place you are doing it all wrong but in this video i'm going to be showing you how to set up your youtube channel properly do it to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to share if you are here to subscribe what are you waiting for subscribe join the family okay so let's get right into the video so the first thing you are going to be doing is to create a channel if you don't have one already so you can either do this on the youtube app or you come to the browser so i'm on my browser right now so you type youtube.com so because google also owns youtube any gmail account that is logged in on your phone is going to appear here but then you can see under here saying create a channel i don't have a channel with this gmail account so you are going to tap on create channel so this hello module you are seeing right here this is the name of my gmail account so if you want to change it or if you want your gmail name to be your youtube channel username you can go ahead to use it but for the sake of this tutorial i'm not going to change it i will just leave it so i'm going to tap on create channel so now you have successfully created a youtube channel for yourself a lot of people after creating channel just go ahead and start posting on youtube which is very wrong you need to customize and set up your youtube channel properly to customize your channel you need to do it on your browser if you open the channel if you created the channel with your app you still need to come back to your browser that's why i even started with the browser so you are going to search for youtube studio on your browser then you tap on login so once you do that you are going to see this page tap on continue then this dashboard is going to appear this is where the old customization and setup is going to happen so this is the dashboard if you tap on content this is where all your videos are going to be showing but because it's a new account you will not see it analytics community but what we have business with right here is the customization so you tap on it you are going to see this space this is where you are going to upload your banner youtube banner you can generate this on canva is not a serious thing if you also come down here you will see picture this is where you upload your profile picture now we can see name now let me explain the difference between name and and because these two names they are going to show on your youtube channel so the name you are seeing right here can be anything and it is not unique to you alone anybody can use it you can see on youtube channel like different people using this particular name so now but when when it comes to andrew the andrew is unique to you alone once you use that andrew no other person can use it so this multiple lifestyle i'm writing right here you can see like 100 people on youtube with this same name now when it comes to andrew andrew is unique to you alone so there are times that when you put a particular andrew youtube might say is not available because someone has already used it so this name i want to put that right now multiple falade i'm going to write it in a different way because i'm very sure that there'll be people bearing this already on youtube so i'm just not going to waste time i'm going to write it in a very unique way and you see that youtube can you see youtube is already marking we mark it that is available if it's not available youtube is going to inform you that the name is not available and you can also decide to change either the name or the handle in every 14 days yeah so the next thing i'm going to be doing is i'm going to be adding my profile picture so i'm just going to be putting my picture but i might not show the banner because i'll need to go and design it on canva there are different templates you can use on canva just go to your canva and type youtube banner and just write like few things that is about your channel and upload it in that section so i'm only going to put my picture so the next one is description this description too you can go to chat gpt and just tell chat gpt things about your channel that you need it for youtube description so you are going to get this and just paste it make sure you proofread it and you know edit it so that everybody will not know that you use chat gpt for it if you scroll up you are going to see your channel url so you can click on this right button to copy it the next one is the link so you can add your social media links to this so you can you first type the name here let's say you want to add tiktok and you copy your tiktok link put it here 
then after that you tap on this ad link you can add instagram or anyone you want to add next one is the contact so you can add your email address then we have video watermark so if you add a video watermark any video you post the watermark is going to show on it so you can put your name there now after doing the profile you are going to move to home tab so in this home tab you come to this button by the right and you toggle it on so this is where you are going to customize how the layout of your channel is going to look like if anybody enters your channel the first thing they are going to see now in this part you might not be able to add anything if your account is new if you don't have any video but i'm going to show you the one for this my account you are watching this video on so now you can add for you like videos you want people to see first on your page short videos if you tap on this add section too you can also add like some sections to it so let me show you how my channel looks like the one you are watching this video so if you open my channel the first video you are going to see is this video right here so i added it as a video my channel trailer so this is what you are going to add and again as your video as your account grows you are going to have more options by this side and then if you go live you're going to have live option you can add a section and then any of your live videos you can put them in that particular section the next one is featured video for returning subscribers so this is the video i selected for that and then the next one is for you is youtube that will recommend some videos to your to anybody that enters your account also the video section youtube is just going to pick like five of your, of your videos then for the popular videos the ones that you have like a very you know large views on it youtube will also pick them for the popular videos on your channel so now let's come back to the new account you are setting up because i didn't finish up this section you will not be able to publish it so i have to like cancel it now you come to this top corner the right hand side you can see publish right here so you are going to tap on it if you don't tap on this your settings will not be saved so you are going to click on publish so we are done with the channel customization part. the next one is the youtube library so if you tap on youtube library you are going to see some free music you can use for your channel and you will not get copyright issues so you can come here to download some sounds now the next thing we are going to be doing right here is the settings there are some important things you also need to set up in this part so once you click on settings you are going to see this so in this part we are going to be doing some settings here so in this general you can see default units please leave it as us dollars don't change it then we have channel if you click on this channel you see country of residence so you are going to tap your country of residence so i'm just going to put nigeria because i am in nigeria so i'm going to pick nigeria for my country of residence you can put anywhere you are there so the next one is keyword you you can just put anything your channel is all about so you can put it there but i'm just going to leave it blank so if you move to the next one you see advanced settings now this one is very important anytime you want to make a post youtube is always asking if your channel is made for kids so if your channel is not made for kids i'll just advise you just click no just set it so that anytime you want to post video youtube will not be asking you so the next one is google ad accounts linking this is for if you are trying to run ad you can link it so this next one is automatic caption so you can just turn it on if you don't want youtube to show potentially inappropriate word that you say in your video so now the next one is advertisements so please don't disable this because when you get monetized you are going to be earning on this ad so you just leave it like that then the next one is clips so this one is saying that if you want people to clip from your video you can decide to allow it or disable it so some people do video clipping they'll just clip a part of your video and repost it so the next one is featured eligibility so in this part it's going to show you like some things you are el el eligible for so standard feature you are eligible for it so this next one that says immediate features is you being able to add custom thumbnails live streaming youtube longer than 15 minutes youtube videos longer than 15 minutes so one thing you need to do is you need to verify your phone number if you don't verify your phone number you will not be able to do all these things so you just tap on verify phone number now my own number is already verified because i have a youtube account so it's linked in a way 
so you just put your phone number and it will be verified so you are going to come back here and tap on save so it's going to take you here but we still have more to do tap on the settings again once you tap on the settings it's going to bring you back here so now the next thing you are going to do is to do your upload defaults so in this upload default you can see title i would advise you leave it blank because you are going to be having different title for different videos even the description just leave it blank you are going to be having different descriptions so, so the next one is visibility i would advise you put it in private or on list this is because if you anytime you want to post your youtube video it will give you time to do a lot of settings or adjustment on your video instead of just setting it to public and everyone can see your video already before you now start editing it so if you move to the right hand side which is the advanced settings you are going to see this comment so you put your comment put it on because you definitely need engagement on your video then the comments moderation put it on basic if you want youtube to also show viewers the number of likes you have you put this on so you save it and then the next thing you are going to do is you come back to settings again so you tap on the next option which is the permissions so if you want anybody to have access to your account you can add them here so you just click on invite and then you put their email and then you can assign the role you want them to be here if you want them to be editor or just anything you can put it here so well i'm not going to add anybody so that's pretty much everything you need to do before you start posting on your youtube channel please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and also subscribe if you are yet to subscribe please subscribe already also drop a comment if you have any question i'll be willing to answer you i'll see you in my next video bye